OnePlus has proven time and again that they can put out some really premium devices. However, smartphones are not really all that they make. If you dig a little bit deeper, there are plenty of other products that OnePlus makes. By the way, regarding the OnePlus 6, I do plan on doing a review of this coming pretty soon. However, in this particular video, we're going to take a look at a different category that OnePlus is trying to penetrate, and that has to do with audio. Now, OnePlus has done audio in the past, including wired headphones, but now they're jumping into the wireless space. These might not be truly wireless headphones, but they are pretty great for what they are. These are the OnePlus Bullets Wireless. The band that puts these all together reminds me of the LG Tones, or even a pair of Jaybird wireless earbuds. And it leans more to the latter because of the inline controls. After all, they are on one of the ears rather than on the band itself. The wings found on the earpieces are reminiscent of Jaybird once again, and they help with keeping the earphones in one's ear without suddenly popping out. And the earbuds themselves stay true to the original wired bullets, sporting a sharp look. The signature red is not really found here except on the weird carrying case that I'll get to in a second. There's just one little logo at the end of the band right next to the USB-C charging port and the one button used for triggering the pairing. Otherwise, the rest of the product is decidedly gray all over except for a couple of accents of red in the controls that are found on one of the ears. This is even more understated than I'd expect from OnePlus. Now, it's kind of hard not to notice when headphones like these are around someone's neck. To some extent, it's kind of like an eyesore, but to basically any user, this form factor also means that the headphones will be hard to lose. This is helped along by magnets in the earbuds themselves, which snap together when you bring them close. This magnetic function also cuts the Bluetooth connection, allowing for some battery savings when not in use. This has actually been really reliable, as I was sure the headphones were off once I snapped the earpieces together and could go straight back to my content when they were separated again and put back in to my ears. If you want to take this functionality to the next level, then you would have to use a OnePlus 6. The reason is because it will autoplay once you separate the two earbuds from their magnets. It's a nice feature to have, but you could always, with other phones, just separate them, put them in your ears, and press play on the inline controls once again. But speaking of having these in one's ears, I've heard a lot of mixed reactions as to how these headphones sound. The headphones do use aptX, the Qualcomm created codec for higher audio quality, but it is a step down from aptX HD. Reports about a total lack of bass are a little heavy handed if you ask me. There is just enough bass to make these headphones enjoyable, but I will admit that they could certainly use a little bit more. I don't see any audiophiles really singing the praises of the Bullets Wireless, but for most casual users, it will be more than enough. And that's before you even factor in the great battery life. The controls are simple, allowing for pausing, playing, volume control, and going to the next song by double pressing the play button. The thing is, I would have preferred to have next or previous track controls programmed into holds of the volume buttons. Holding down the play button does allow you to get to Google Assistant, which works just the same way as any other Bluetooth headset. The one thing I don't like about these headphones is the case. It's just not very intuitive. Or better put, how exactly am I supposed to put them in here? There's gotta be a right way to do it, but no one really knows. Clearly they don't fit without plenty of coiling or bending, which makes me feel a little anxious about the durability of the headphones if this is something I have to do all the time. But then, here we are, at the best part. Where these headphones really shine is in the battery life. OnePlus claimed that the headphones are able to go for eight hours on a full charge, which is above average, but not necessarily exceptional. But it's that USB Type-C port that makes all the difference due to the headphones' own version of dash charging. Using any standard cable, actually, you can get the bullets charged to over half battery, and by that, they mean five hours of listening time in just 15 minutes. For anyone that wants to use these headphones as a travel companion, and that's exactly what I've done on a couple of flights recently, the ratio between the time it takes to charge them and the return is great for long flights and commutes. And honestly, it's that type of reliability that has been great about using these bullets wireless. I've used them as my main headphones for quite some time, but I actually most enjoy having them as a backup when any of my other headsets run out of juice. And sometimes, you know what? I don't really want to bring my heavy headphones or worry about returning my truly wireless earbuds to their cases when I need to charge them for a period of time. Instead, this lightweight design and the fast charging make the bullets wireless an easy addition to a rotation of headphones. And this recommendation is even easier to give considering how affordable these are. Even if your phones still have headphone jacks, cutting the cord is easy with OnePlus because of the $69 price tag. So if you're not an audiophile, the ease of use and reliability could be what makes these headphones still a compelling choice. As always, thank you guys very much for watching and hope you enjoyed this video on the OnePlus Bullets Wireless. Uh, audio products are pretty important to me uh, because I try to have one around my neck or in my ears pretty much all the time because I have YouTube, podcasts, audiobooks, 
or just music in the background whenever I'm working or just kind of roaming about. Uh, so the OnePlus Bullets Wireless are in a rotation of products that I use. And uh, the other headphones that you saw in this video, I will review at some point. Speaking of which, I do have a review schedule that is coming up and I'm planning on reviewing the OnePlus 6 so you can look forward to my thoughts on this pretty awesome phone. And until then, you can subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, drop some thumbs up on my videos, and also get into the comments sections so we can have discussions about everything that I cover. So until the next video, I'm going to go ahead and call it on this one and remind you to enjoy your tea, everybody.